What's up, cinema lovers, and welcome to another episode of Two High Cinemas. I'm your host, Sharim. And here on Two High Cinemas, I like to give my opinion on some of the most popular pieces of cinema in the world. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a run through and review of WandaVision Episode 4, starring Elizabeth Olsen and Paul Bettany. Now let's get into it. After Monica Rambeau, an agent of SWORD, returns to life following the blip to find her mother, Maria, has died of cancer. Three weeks later, Rambeau returns to work and is sent by acting director Tyler Hayward to help FBI agent Jimmy Woo with the missing persons case in Westview, New Jersey. They discover a hexagonal static CMBR field surrounding the town, which Rambeau is pulled into. Within 24 hours, SWORD establishes a base around the town and sends drones and agent in to investigate. On that note, don't forget to check out some of our merch options provided by KLB Supply at klbsupply.com. Follow KLB Supply and Two High Cinemas on all social media platforms. Like and subscribe for any updates. And let's get back into it. Dr. Darcy Lewis studies the phenomena and discovers broadcast signals for the sitcom WandaVision. They use these to observe events inside the town, learning that real residents have been cast in the sitcom and seeing Rambo appear as Geraldine. Lewis and Wu unsuccessfully attempt to use the radio to contact Maximoff. When Rambo mentions Ultron, Maximoff casts her out of the town. Maximoff then temporarily sees Vision appear as he did when he died, before setting back into her sitcom life with him. Alright, so the review. Now we are in the meat of the mystery. Uh, we get another perspective of uh, the blip from Captain Monica Rambo, uh, aka Lieutenant Trouble, uh, which was haunting. Uh, we get Sword. Uh, we get an outside look of Westview, the uh, reintroduction of the, uh, you know, the homie Jimmy Woo. Uh, we get a link to the color helicopter from episode two. We get Dr. Darcy Lewis back. Uh, we see how Monica becomes Geraldine, and we even get a brief scientific explanation of how the force field works and how they can see in it. Uh, thanks to Darcy. Uh, we get a link back to the scene with Dottie breaking character in episode two. And lastly, we get reminded of Vision's death in Infinity War. So it was pretty good. Like this was like really, this really hit it. Like this was, is right, revving it up. So now when it comes to the rank, comedy, mids, drama, dank, action, dank, horror, dank. And that was my run through and review of today's movie. Please hit the like, subscribe, and comment down below on what you would like me to review next. For now, smoke you later.